before comedy duos like Mike Myers and Dana Carvey or Dean Martin and Jerry Lewis hit the big screen, another couple of clowns created movie magic. Janelle Walton celebrates the lasting legacy of Laurel and Hardy around town. Bruce McCollum's taste in classic movies has never wavered, staying with him through thick and thin. I just love Laurel and Hardy so much that uh, they mesmerized me. The retired teacher is devoted to the classic comedians with a room filled with mementos of the hefty Oliver Hardy and the slender Stan Laurel. I'm always looking, my, my family, my friends, but my relatives, they're always looking and calling me up and asking me if I have this or have that. One of the comedic team's enduring appeals is that it is family-friendly entertainment. You don't hear any bad words. The topic has nothing that would offend a child or even an adult. Want to sample the slapstick? Bruce gave us his favorite films. Sons of the Desert, Music Box, Blockheads, and finally I'd end with The Chimp. Gene Sorkin founded the Chimp Tent, Cincinnati's chapter of the International Laurel and Hardy Appreciation Society. Each group is called a tent. Every tent is named after a Laurel and Hardy movie. Gene hosts a Laurel and Hardy film session every other month, including this Saturday night. I pick a theme, like the upcoming theme for um, February 9th meeting is 1933. We'll show films from 1933. The lights dim for the family-friendly screening at 6.45 p.m. at the Seasons Retirement Community in Kenwood. The cost is $5 per person, with kids 12 and under free. There's another event around town for movie fans. You can see several Oscar-nominated films all on the same day at Newport on the Levee. AMC is hosting Best Picture Showcase 2013 Oscar nominees. Saturday, February 16th, you can see Amour, Les Mis, Argo, and Django for $30. The other films are showing the following Saturday for $40. Bucks. Go to amctheaters.com for details. For the list, I'm Janelle Walton.